Hey guys, <clears throat> Spunky here, and as you can see, my friend just messaged me. Um, <clears throat> but uh, I'm bringing you a few video tutorials on how to brick. Um, basically, what I'm going to be doing throughout these videos is um, I'm going to show you guys basically every viable way to play brick effectively. Um, with a couple of what the fuck's thrown in there. And uh, this video, uh, uh, I'm not sure if I ever said, but it's brought to you by the Borderlands forums. <coughs> so I'm going to start it off with my personal favorite, the melee brick. And what you're going to need gear wise is a 60% health boost, boost shield with a decently good capacity and a decently good recharge rate, but you're basically just going for this health boost right here. Oh! didn't want to do that. Um, <coughs> you need this skirmisher mod. Yes, I know it's level 61. That's only supposed to be level 55. But, whatever. It doesn't really change that much. I think this is just supposed to be plus 58 team melee damage. But, um, anyway, so you need, you need the, the plus 4 and short fuse. You need it. It's an absolute must if you want to Berserk and Nox, really, which is what I'm going to be doing, and you need this plus 42% team maximum health boost as well. Uh, skill point wise, you're going to want to have it to look like this. I will post a, a link for you guys in the thread that I'm going to post this video in that has the uh, all this in it, all the detailed information, <clears throat> but you need all level sixes as well. We well, don't really need them, but you should have them anyway. Um, I'm in playthrough 2.5. I've already beaten Nox. Um, all this stuff I just have to have. I have that, 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 that. This will help you quite a bit. This will kind of help you, especially with like uh, Nox or somebody. Um, this will help you get second wins. This is just for giggles. But yeah. Anyway, so we're going to go corrosive punch, and I'm playing at 30 FPS here. So excuse me if I suck a little more than usual. But anyway, this is the most viable part of Nox because you have level 60s instead of level, you know, 55 or whatever. As you can see, I'm already off to a very bad start. <laughs> That's okay. Oh, look at that. And I am playing solo. Um, Bloodsport is a must. An absolute must. If you're preserving. Um... You just absolutely need it. So as you see here, I just got downed, but on its way. Like I said, I suck a little more than usual because 30 FPS, the scraps lag kind of sucks. But I still think I'm doing all right. Um, and then I will go. I'll show you some gameplay um, of how difficult it is with a uh, Xbox 360 controller. So I'll pick that up right now. As you can see, I have it. Um, I'll put it on my settings right quick. Uh, gamepad. Sensitivity should be... Right, look. Alright. And I think that this... Yes. Alright. So this is gameplay. Gamepad-wise. As you can see, it's a little more difficult with the gamepad, but it's not terribly difficult. Okay. Um, jump, critical, all that fancy stuff. And uh, yeah, so I will do this next section here, which is going to take a little bit. Oh my god, sorry about that. Sister walked in, she wanted something. Um, oh, shit. Yeah, I'm going to... Do that. Hopefully it won't shake. <laughs> okay. Couple bloopers, whatever. Oh, shit. That needs... Yeah, I forgot this, like, the invert look. And I think the sensitivity as well. Mouse keyboard. No, it's not okay. So I'll try and do this. Um, up here, it's full of like um, chemical lance. So 
corrosive's not really going to be that effective. I like to use shock to get rid of their shields, even though it's not really that great against their, uh, you know, their armor or whatever. But they buff shock, so as long as you can get criticals, it's not too hard. As you can see, I'm having a fairly easy time. Once you start to get a little low, pull out something that's good, and then keep berserking. Oh, look at that thing like be critical. That wasn't good. As you can see, berserking is completely viable in Nox. I mean, Sure, this is not you know four players, but if you can do this solo, I think it's just as good as four players. A shock trooper? No, well, that's not gonna work. Sometimes they surprise you. Oh, it's not. Gonna and I'm gonna down, probably. Surprise! Yep, there we go. Chemical trooper. So we need to pull this out. Oh, Alright. Um and then I guess like that part is gonna be a little difficult with a 360 control. I'm gonna show you what Brick can do actually. This is kinda funny. You can actually punch Rocketeers and flying objects if you get directly under them. So if you get directly under them, yes you can punch them out of the air. Um so you don't need to stop reserving and uh, wait for them to get, you know, to use a gun on them, so just thought I'd share that little, little tip with you. Alright, and uh, I will show you how you fares against these two badasses, whatever they're going to be up here, and then that will be video. So what do we got? We got a badass defender and a badass pyro. So we can go ahead and go to corrosive punch. Take out the defender first. I don't know, they're level 57, so they're all easy. And then sting like a beat up cut. And that's that. And it'll explode. So watch out for that. And yeah, that's that. So that's basically how you uh, berserk and knock. Like, like I said, I'm on PC, so on consoles it's going to be a little bit more difficult due to the fact that you guys are using a controller. You can't turn as fast. You don't have as much precision as I do, even though that's a bad example. But um, yeah, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope this helps you guys who want to know how to knock or berserk and knock. And, if you're not sure of how good it is, well, I hope this video shows that it is viable. Um, Cromorax, though, with this build, is completely out of the question because you cannot melee him to death whatsoever. You will die, and you will die hard. So, if you want to not, if you want to do Cromorax with this build, you're going to need a few friends. So, I'm Spunky. I hope this has helped you guys, and I will see you guys in the next video.